Hey guys, it's Mr. AJ's Tech here. Today I got a video of um, the iOS 5. Um, basically, I'm going to show you what it would be like to unbox an iPad if it was just, um, if you just bought it, you're unboxing it and it has iOS 5 pre installed. So, this is kind of like going into the future. So, this would be like you get an iPad, you don't have a computer. So, you just open up the box, you undo the plastic, of course, already. You open it up, there's the iPad, brand new. Of course, this is my iPad one. You cannot do anything, of course, because it's not activated. So we're going to pull it out of the packaging, of course. And we do that. Of course, we have all this stuff under there with the fingertips and all that. So once you unbox the actual iPad, usually you have to plug it into the computer. But actually, you can just boot. So we'll just start with the first boot. Usually goes to the recovery logo. But this is actually showing you what it would be like if we had iOS 5 pre-installed when you bought a product. It is kind of uh, cool that I fished out the old iPad 1 box. So here we go. We actually had a little transition for the Apple logo. So that's pretty cool. And uh, you can see right here, it's activated without having to, um, you know, plug it into the computer. So as you can see, I'll have a cord connected. So right here it says iPad, slide to setup. Okay, and we have all our languages. We're going to click English. And the countries, we got all these countries. We are going to click United States. Next. Choose a Wi-Fi network. So we got our Wi-Fi network installing, and I do not have my SIM card in my iPad 1. I have it in my iPad 2 3G. So that's why it's displaying no SIM up there. Click Next. So we're at this screen right here, and we can restore from iCloud Backup, which would basically, um, it's not fully functional right now, but it basically allow me to back up from my iPad 2 to right to my iPad 1, which would be pretty cool. But we're just going to set up as a new iPad. And I'll sign in with my Apple ID. Okay, and once I signed up, signed in with my iTunes account, it gives us an ability to sync. So this is going to be syncing with my iPad 2. Click Next. Find my iPad on. Next. And uh, I'm going to set up automatically send so that just so that helps the beta. So now we can just do right here. Your iPad is now set up. Start using iPad. So here we are, home screen, iOS 5, there we go, messages, and newsstand. So I did do a video on this yesterday, but I thought it would be cool to do kind of a future unboxing. So I hope you like this video and look forward to more videos. So now that I have my iPad 1 on iOS 5, I can now show you guys the messages app. So I'll show you messages app from here to here. So that would be cool, and I hope you like this video. Rate, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you next video. See ya.